For some 30 years, Dr. Fran Schelling has been on a frustrating mission to get someone to investigate his theory that some patients with MS seem to have poor blood flow out of their brains, possibly caused by damaged veins, but no one would listen. I went to Vienna, to Zurich, to Brussels, uh, to Philadelphia, to New York, to London. And, uh, Your message was? Check the veins in MS. He had collected decades of research that also pointed to brain damage in those with the disease. But his requests for more studies were repeatedly rejected by MS specialists who insisted MS was caused by immune problems, not the veins. It really <laughs> cracked me down <laughs> to, because I had patients that had uh, patients died of MS. But that long ignored theory is now being explored at high speed. Breath in and out. Scientists from Europe and Canada are in Italy to learn how to test for vein problems using a technique developed by Dr. Paolo Zamboni, who discovered many MS patients indeed have blocked veins and that opening them might lessen some of the symptoms by restoring proper blood flow. The interest is really exploding and we are moving uh, really fast. At least a dozen studies are now planned or underway around the world. We don't want to let this languish and go on for a long period of time. We really want to get to the bottom of this. But studies will take time. It may be a few years, but very quickly we'll get to results that help us make sure that treatments are offered with the appropriate safeguards. But scientists here hope to have preliminary results in less than a year, with patients around the world waiting for an answer. Avis Favreau, CTV News. Ferrara, Italy.